In this video, we want to look at how to run the payables invoice register. And we are going to view the invoice that we created earlier on for lease supplies within the report. So there's a few ways of running reports. You can go to tools, scheduled processes, or you can select it from the navigator on the tools. You'll be able to see your scheduled processes. So I'm going to select scheduled processes and I'm going to go to my schedule a new process and search for payables invoice register payables invoice register so that's the last one there click on OK and OK again and this will bring me the details so I'm going to uh, put in the supply name which is my Lee supplies Lee supplies invoice type I can do by invoice type so I'm actually running a report now Invoice type could be my standard or all of them entered by, I could say I want everything entered by a particular person. So there's a few people that I could search from. I could say that I want to look at all that has been entered today and I could specify whether it's cancelled invoice only or unvalidated invoices. So I'm going to say entered from yesterday and submit so this will send a request to the server and we'll be able to view the report details in a few minutes so it's ready to run let's refresh completed and we should be able to see the output in a few moments So select the the report. Let's click on refresh again. So that's succeeded. So you want to select the report or the process that you've run, and then you will see the output. It's actually in a PDF format. So I'm going to say republish, and I'm going to select export. Let's have a look at this in Excel. And my Excel report has been downloaded. So let's have a look at the next page. And we can see the invoice. So this is the invoice that we created earlier on. Lease supplies. And you can see that it's not accounted for. No accounting, you can see the details of the invoice that we entered a few moments ago. So description, consultant services, you can see the tax, or well, there is another invoice, some other invoices generated in the last few days. Well, that's the invoice that we created uh, a few moments ago. So that's how to run the invoice register report. So thanks for watching and see you in the next video.